see here a question is uh, at 50 hertz operation a single phase transformer has hysteresis loss of 200 watt and eddy current loss of 100 watt uh, given here that 50 hertz operation uh, uh, in a uh, in a single phase transformer the hysteresis loss is 200 watt okay and eddy current loss is 100 watt now its core loss at 60 hertz operation at constant flux density it is said that uh, at constant flux density at 60 hertz operation what will be the hysteresis loss and eddy current loss okay we know that expression for hysteresis loss kh frequency bm to the power x okay watt per meter cube okay this is the expression for hysteresis loss okay but uh, it is already mentioned that it is already constant okay this is the hysteresis constant and in the question itself it is given magnetic field density is constant okay so here in this situation hysteresis loss is only dependent on frequency okay so we can say that hysteresis loss is directly proportional to frequency okay now what about uh, eddy current let's see expression for eddy current eddy current loss it is ke f square okay bm square into t square okay this is also watt per meter cube okay this is constant this is the thickness of core okay this is also constant and already said bm already mentioned in the question it is also constant so eddy current is proportional to eddy current loss is proportional to f square okay now both are both are dependent on frequency okay this is directly proportional to frequency this is the square of frequency eddy current loss is proportional to square of the frequency okay so what will be the new new hysteresis loss and eddy current loss at 60 years we are required to calculate okay let's calculate it so new hysteresis loss is equal to it is directly proportional to frequency okay so at 60 hertz hysteresis loss will be more okay what will be the new frequency sorry what will be the new loss 60 divided by 50 into what was the previous loss to into 200 watt okay this is the new hysteresis loss what will be the new eddy current loss eddy current loss is uh, directly proportional to square of the frequency so new this is 60 divided by 50 square what is the previous loss it was 100 okay let's take the help of calculator 60 divided by 50 into 200 this is 240 240 watt okay and 60 divided by 50 whole square into 100 it is 144 loss total total loss 240 plus 144 okay 240 plus 144 this is 384 okay so where is 384 b option b option is correct okay thank you